Migration between Mexico and the United States has a long history, characterized by the annual northward migration of hundreds of thousands of Mexicans seeking a better life. Since the pandemic generalized remote work, many people have the freedom to live anywhere, and some Americans have chosen Mexico, giving rise to robust reverse migration. In Mexico City, there are companies that specialize in working with foreigners to help them find dwelling places. Ahora sí llega más. Eh, te explico. Eh, 70% de nuestros clientes son extranjeros. Eh, de estos 70, eh, 75% son de Estados Unidos, 15 de Canadá y 10 de Europa. Sí, está aumentando exactamente después de la pandemia. Eh, tenemos ahora un boom y sí hay mucho, eh, mucho más. Tenemos dos tipos de extranjeros que llegan a México. Eh, déjame te explico. Los primeros son jóvenes entre 20 y 40 años. Eh, muchos de ellos son nómadas digitales. El segundo son los retirados, que para ellos sí es importante eh, este sector de, de dinero. According to official data, from January to September 2022, Mexican authorities issued 8,412 temporary resident cards to Americans, a 23% increase over the same period last year. During the COVID-19 pandemic, many companies have offered a remote working option, which has given employees much flexibility, and Americans also benefit from a favorable exchange rate that makes their money more profitable. Because I work remotely, like. I get paid in like USD. I think a lot of Americans would say that the cost of living is like inflation is like wild in, in the States. And it was, and that was like one of like the factors that made me like look elsewhere. However, the influx of Americans has inevitably made the local rents go up, especially in foreigners' preferred areas. Y este fenómeno al mismo tiempo tiene un impacto inmobiliario. Por ejemplo, durante toda la pandemia las rentas en la Roma Condesa nunca bajaron el precio. Esto porque había extranjeros viniendo a vivir para acá, pero acá les sale muchísimo más barato. Todo de alguna manera termina por acelerar un proceso de gentrificación. 